Give the woman her children. Stop using kids as a defense to a low esteem. Blessing CEO Blast FFK. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. Popular relations expert Blessing Okoro, better known as Blessing CEO, has weighed in on the marital crisis between former aviation minister Femi Fane Coyote and his estranged wife. Precious Chikwendo, as the duo have continued to be in the news one year after the parted ways. I've said this thing before in the previous news. On this particular issue, eh, do not like as a husband and a wife, no matter your differences, do not use your children as a point of attack or a point of defense. Don't do that. Don't do that. Not even especially when these children are minors. When they are still children, no now, it's not fair. No matter your problem, see, two people know marriage is between two people. This one I'm hearing buzz here that the pastor is coming out to talk and it even shows that one of them is not matured. So be sincere with me. Now, that aside, that is not even the case study here. This particular lady, don't use her children against her. She is saying on some news, I think some news went viral that she's noticing like, you know, bruises on her child's face and you know, she's like, she doesn't feel they are safe. There is no child that is going to grow up loving you after he or she find out that you ruined their childhood. These children, as their children now, this is the time where they live, they need more than a love, attention and all of that. Sincerely, the court should do it in such a way that both the man and the wife would be be able to visit their children even if it is with the supervision of 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 each uh, each of them but you don't take a woman from like one year what like how why a mother is a mother just imagine you as a mother your 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 child did not tell you even if this person is grown that he or she was not going to come back like maybe he went out as even uh, even if that child is your young adult you become worried about that person not to talk of your children who they did not have a say. They were taken away from you and from pictures of what you're saying. These children are looking like, you know, that they are not being taken care of well. Please give this woman, like the trauma of taking um, one kid away from a person. You don't know what is happening to your children. You don't want to be there to be sincere. Mothers can relate. Allow these people, allow her to have her children, even if it means you going to visit them every once in a while. Now the news in detail. Recall that Fanny Kaede had in 2020 accused as a strange wife of having extramarital affair with a Navy officer in an undisclosed Abuja hotel that he had, that he had the evidence, a video clip with him. However, the recent crisis between the two former lovebirds caught many unawares as the former minister of aviation said his wife is suffering from mental illness. According to a statement cancelled to Fanny Kayode's lawyer, Ayodeji Sunday Ibikunle, on the opera official page of the former minister, the former beauty pageant is suffering from a bipolar disorder and that she is mentally un unstable. We are constrained to point out the fact that Ms. Precious Chikwendo, the former partner of her client, Chief Femi Fanny Kayode, Saudakin Shinkafi, is suffering from bipolar disorder and schizophrenia. And we acknowledge the fact that she is totally insane that statements read in part. The statement further said it will be disgraceful and absurd to respond to allegations of an insane person and that Ms. Chikwendu is known for telling lies and making delusional statements after Ms. Precious Chikwendu recently said her sons have contended COVID-19. Commenting on the marital crisis between the former beauty queen and the all-progressive chieftain in an Instagram post on Friday, blessing CEO slams the later for not handing over the children to their estranged wife. Narrating what she passed through in her marriage before divorce, blessing CEO said her ex-husband took away her son from her when he was just two weeks old, gave the baby to his mother and stopped her from breastfeeding him so that she would not transfer her witch to him. He said I was mental and unstable. Then my mom told him even a mad woman cannot harm her own child. Give her her child. Until we finally separated and he took him when he was eight months again. I fought for five years to get him back. 
at Snow White, he has four boys. Mine was just one, and I know the pain I felt. Give her her child. Stop using kids as a defense to low esteem and insecurities. Give the woman her children. Blessing CEO insisted as she accompanied her post with a photo of Miss Precious Chikwendo and her eldest son. She also said her ex-husband claimed that she was mentally unstable and that she took the baby away from him when he was eight months old, but she fought on for five years to get the baby back from him. Blessing CEO maintained that no court will grant Fanny Coyote's custody of those children, urging Miss Precious Chikwendo to stand her ground and get her children back. The relationship expert finally said that said what has transpired in the marriage between the duo Fanny said what has actually transpired in the marriage between the duo, but as a mother that serves her children and people will keep screaming until she gets those children while stressing that the recent statement of Fanny Coyote is nothing but bullying, manipulative and narcissistic behavior. Well, 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 like, no now. The children is really, this, the, from, from, from the pictures I see here, these children are really, 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 like, they are really small. Uh-uh, no now. This is the time that they need all the love. You're not even supposed to even allow them to even know what exactly is even going on. Yes, you're not even supposed to allow them know. There should be like an agreement. You will be able to see them. The mother will take care of them better. No, no. With all the politics and everything he's going to, he is not going to be able to give these children his time. Allow the mother to have the children, no matter what has happened in the marriage. I don't want to believe, even just as um, Blessing CEO here said, no matter how mad a woman is, having to see mad women with babies, do they harm them? No, they don't. Like, I don't understand. No, 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 no. If both of them are wise enough, and if he, FFK, is wise enough, sincerely, he would not even allow the children to know what is going on. But the way the situation is, is portraying itself now, it is even seeming like he's, He's masterminding them, not even wanting them to see their mother again, which is not is so unwise of him. There is no way that he can replace the love and the affection of it. These children, they will grow up with resentment in their hearts. They are still minors for crying out loud. No, 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 no. No. And he's even coming out to say that this person is bipolar and I wow. Like wow. Wow. She is bipolar and you managed and she's mentally unstable and you stayed with her for how many years? Bravo. Now, this is not even our problem. The problem or what Nigerians insist or what the right thing should do. Give these 